What's up guys, your boy Chris Good Game back at it again with another amazing video, man. Today your boy is in Dragon Ball Sparking Zero, man. And today, man, I'm gonna show you guys how to do the uh, super counter, revenge counter. I even been seeing some people call it back shots. When I seen that, I was like, whoa, you feel me? like, okay, people going with that. But man, you know what I'm saying, this gonna be a tutorial for noobs because guess what man your boys are noobs still too man but guess what i get i get you feeling just a little gist of it man and i've been seeing people uh trying to uh like counter um uh when you, you they punch you and flying behind you and all that crazy stuff i know uh i done lost a lot of fights like that man what people call it call them back shots super counter revenge counter Oh, that we, we, I'm gonna show y'all how to do it um the new way because that's what I'm a noob and probably some of y'all are just still a noob so I'm trying to break it down the best way I can so what you gonna do man first you guys wanna go to the uh, training man once you get in training man you gonna go to uh training settings and you gonna go to appointed uh settings and you gonna put it on what is that uh, I gotta go find it there you go it's called smash attacks and follow ups three you gonna put it on there man so once you do that, uh, he should, you know what I'm saying, start punching and stuff like that. And doing that. I'm not done. So that's the that's the little stuff you feel me that um you hate dealing with and uh, what you call it. And you can see look, that's a counter right there. So when that happens right there, man, uh I'm gonna pause it. So uh well, you see what I just did? So all I did was move the left analog stick up and hit square, guys. It's literally all about the time and the time is killing everybody like literally like it's literally the time it's like you get like a split second of time it that's literally all it is you just gotta time it good now watch this i'm gonna show you the other uh what you guys i'm, I'm gonna show you this one again but hold on Show you this one again. Look at that. Get you. Look at that. See, look, I counter. All you doing is moving the analog stick uh, button up. See, like I, like I just showed you. All you guys is moving the analog stick button up and hitting square at the right times. You ain't going to get it all the time. I'm telling you. You feel me? You not going to get it every time. You might have some people you play online who just better at you with. They just mastered it. They got ultra instinct when it comes to counters. But I'm telling you, all you got to do is move the analog stick up and hit square literally when you fight man the only two buttons you really should be moving is the uh, left analog stick button square and all one to do the vanish like once you vanish like look at this i'll uh, vanish yeah. so, look. So he got me watching him try to try to uh, counter so, counter you so, give me See, look counter like i told you it's all about the time on it it's literally all about the time. Once you get that time down to, you know what I'm saying, the T, like, once you get it down to that second that you know it's gonna happen, you guys are gonna be good, man. I'm telling you. Uh, like I said, I'm gonna let it hit me. You see, try to do it again. See, there we go, look, I counted it. Well, I didn't get the second time. Uh, then when you're doing a little step, uh, what is it, a little step flash, what you wanna call it, like this. Hold on, oh, you got knocked down. Like I said, move the analog stick up and hit square. You know what I to Look at that. Mm, counter. Analog stick up and square. Now, and oh, I forgot. Sometimes when they do that, you can grab them. Try to do a little grab. That's another way. Mm. So look, you can try to grab one in there. Um, before the uh, try to do a little counter. See, look, you seen it? Got him. Here, R1 and Squall, you can just grab him before they even try to do the counter. See, look, he got me that time. I right, went to grab him. See, look, got him again. That's another way you can stop him. So, mm, that's squ up and Squall. See, look, that was up and Squall, and that was R1 and uh, Squall, man. There's two ways to counter it, man. Oh, he got me. Mm. 
Like I said, left analog stick up, square, and sometimes you can counter with R1 as well. There we go, look. Mm. Oh, you got me. See, like I said, I'm gonna do two men, so I don't, you know what I'm saying, pretty much know how to counter it all the time. Oh, I'm not trying to do that. Oh, yeah, hit with that. But yeah, I don't know how to, uh, too much counter it that good to me. I'm just starting out with, I'm trying to show you guys how to do it. I know how to do it, it just look. Mm. Just count that. But yeah, it's, uh, move the analog, uh, the left analog stick up, square, and sometimes you can just, uh, hit R1 and square. That's two counters that'll work for you, man. You can get them away, hit them with a Kamehameha, you grab them, get them low, then go over the towards them, right on the ground, look. Oh my god, you got See, look, I counted it. That's, that's probably the hardest one when uh, he's chasing after you. That little got to be the hardest one. Take times ten. I don't know if I do that too. But like I said, man, uh, uh, what is analog stick? Left analog stick and square gonna be a uh, look. You got me. Again. It's just all about the timing, man. Yeah, that, that, that works really good. Look, got it. Got that time. It's all about the timing. Mm, see, look. Come on, I hate you. Mm. There we go. Ugh. That's, a, that's probably going to be the hardest one right now. It's, uh, little follow-ups. That... I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not done. Yeah. I'm not done. Yeah. I'm not done. There we go. Got him. It, that's literally the hardest one, y'all. Like, it's literally the hardest one with the follow ups. You gotta get it that second, or he gonna keep hitting you. Like, he, you gotta get it that second. Uh, like I said, we're gonna, uh, like I said, yeah, yeah, yeah. we're doing um the little counter, analog stick up and square. If that one ain't working for you, you can get in front of them or when it's square. You grab them, before you do the counter, you can throw them. Uh, and then uh, like I said, R1 itself is gonna be your best friend for vanishes and stuff like that. Like it's gonna be your best friend for vanishes, get behind them. See look, with a counter. See look, counter. Oh, try to grab them. Do that. Here it goes. I'm not done. Oh. Here it goes. I'm not done. Look. Got on again. Grab him. Go away. Oh, I'm changing the settings. Make him go still again. Uh. Change it back to stand still. But yeah, man, like I was saying, man, uh, that's gonna, that's how you do the super counter, revenge counter, uh, aka the back shots. Well, that's what people call it, you know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't call it that. I just call it like a super counter or something like that, revenge counter. They call it the back shots. Like, if you want to avoid the back shots, man, uh, like I said, left analog stick and square gonna be your best friend. Uh, R1 and square gonna be your best friend. And R1 in general is going to be your best friend, man. All, like, Vanishing, man. That's going to be uh, your best friend. Vanishing and uh, the Super Counter, man. Those are going to be your best friend to win fights. Because that's literally what everybody's doing online, playing rank. They're going too crazy with it, man. That's literally how people lose the fights. They'll uh, do a counter, uh, charge at you, then hit you with an ultimate. And the fight's already over with, man. But, yeah, that's how to avoid that, man. That's how not to get the AKA back shots. Uh, super counter, revenge counter, man. If you guys enjoyed this uh, video and it was helpful for you guys, make sure you guys leave a like. Make sure you guys smash that subscribe button. If you guys want to see more videos like this, and most important, make sure you guys hit that bell icon so you guys get notified when your boy drops a video or goes live. But man, that's it for the uh, video, man. It's your boy Chris Good Gaming. Until next time, I'm out, man. Peace.